If this is Iran's answer to President Obama's extended hand, then the chances of diplomacy heading off Iran's nuclear weapons program are not good. The Iranians claimed it was a success, and Defense Secretary Gates agreed. That it was a successful flight test. Uh, the missile will have a range of uh, approximately 2,000 to 2,500 kilometers. That's 12 to 1,500 miles, more than enough to reach Israel and even parts of Europe. But the Iranians don't yet have a reliable weapon. Because of some of the problems they've had with their engines, we think, at least at this stage of the testing, it's probably closer to the lower end of that range. At the same time, Iran continues enriching uranium, although not yet to bomb grade levels. The CIA estimates Iran could have a nuclear weapon sometime between 2010 and 15. But both the U.S. and Israel have launched covert operations designed to throw sand in the gears by supplying faulty parts or designs. And Secretary of State Clinton indicated Iran may be experiencing delays. Recent analyses have suggested the timetable may be longer than what had originally been uh, thought. But John Hanna, national security advisor to former Vice President Cheney, says Iran's intent remains the same. Clearly perfecting their delivery systems, racing full scale ahead on trying to get sufficient fissile material for a bomb. But President weapon. Obama told Israel's prime minister he's prepared to give diplomacy several more months to produce results. Uh, we should have a fairly good sense by the end of the year uh, as to whether they are uh, moving in the right direction. U.S. officials are hoping for a more moderate government after elections in June, but the real powers in Iran are the mullahs, and they're not up for re-election. Katie? David Martin reporting from the Pentagon tonight.